Well, welcome back to Ostriv. This is Mark with Northern Ants Gaming, and we are in patch three now, Alpha Four. And we're going to continue our journey today. Let's see what we got building. We got over here, we're working on the trading post, which will be good to get that up and going because we can start getting these resources that we are not able to produce on our own. Got the bridge done. A couple other houses done. We are early spring, so they should be working on the fields. Yeah, it looks like some they're walking around the fields there, so should be starting to work on them. Let's up our speed a little bit. Oh, that's what she's doing, walking back and forth, and she's working on them. It's nice that they're using the trees that we had planted. to be a lot of little kids running around the town. Let's see what we got in our school here. Four kids in the school. That's good. Yeah, right now it looks like they're probably not working too much on the house because of the or the training place because of the fact that they everybody's working on the farms right now. Do to have still have two people working in the construction, which is nice having the construction office because now we have a way to specifically assign them to it so they're not all doing other tasks. Oh, this is nice. It's a fairly large yard. I know we can get uh, beehives now also. Let's see what we got here. We might want to set up a second fishing dock so we can get more. Let's do that. Let's set up another fishing dock. Maybe do it on this side of the bridge, maybe? Uh, will they be able to get... Yeah, they should be able to get another boat down here. This will give them an opportunity to fish at a little bit different area. These houses here are probably going to be needing a trading post or a, a market stall, I mean. Let's get one set up right here. See what should we put in this one? Some flour. Pretty much things that we know we can make, like fish and flour and uh, firewood. I know we got potatoes, I'm pretty sure. And then where's the firewood at? Fire, fire, fire. There it is. The firewood. That'll give these houses a little more opportunity to, to get food. Which I put it backwards to what I wanted to, but oh well. Boy, these houses are having trouble with their food variety, that's for sure. Once we get that trading post completed, then we'll be able to trade for some other meats and stuff, which will give us more of a variety. Could set up another housing area over in this area, like close to the farm, because I know we did this area was fields already. I don't know if it regains its nutrients after a time or not. Well, maybe we'll just continue our housing over this side. I love that, how they can plant their own crops now. I'm kind of done doing the houses that are without. I'm going to have to cut a couple trees for this. 
let's do a little more customization on this house again. Um, let's see. Now we pick on, click on these corners to, to move them, I think. Yep. We're going to have to cut quite a few trees, but that'll be okay because we're going to need the lumber anyways. I want to do that, and then we're going to move this house to this corner. I love this whole feature now. Let's, let's turn the house like this. I don't even give him a bigger yard. And now to build, start construction, hit enter. Let's move this house into the feature a little bit farther. It is June. Our farm hand should be pretty much done. Let's take a couple of them off of that so we can get more onto their chores. Come on guys, let's get working here. Let's get our get more construction guys going. There we go. Let's see if we uh how far down can we go down and pay before they start quitting. Still working. That's that's good. They should be over here on this trading post. Oh, they they need to be bribed. down to we're losing a lot of money with the pay being so high up but I really need this to be completed overview I haven't looked at these menus down in the corner yet but I think we're gonna hold off on that still Okay, that's the town hall. That's where the builders used to be at. We don't need them in here anymore because we have them in the construction building. So all the progress they've been making on that trading post in the, the little progression bar does not look like it's moved. Well, they've got this pier right here. They were calling for water. Where's our closest well? There's a well there, and there's a tr water there, so that should be good enough. Let's zoom out for a second, kind of get an overview of our people that are in need of food. <laughs> It's not that they don't have food, they just have a lack of variety of food with that symbol. Does this tell us what the foods are that they're making? Okay, well, no, that's... That's just saying what they have actually in their stock. Which they've got a variety there. But they don't have any fish. Oh, I hope I put enough people on fishing. Three. Yeah, that's all I need. They've only got three boats. I don't think you can get more than three boats, can you? Can we build another? No, it doesn't show building another boat either. 
I think it would give us an indicator that there was another boat available. Let's see. I wonder if decorations have any purpose to them, or if they're just strictly eye candy and not anything that has to do with uh, functionality. I don't have the new town hall yet, which is alright still. I've got that cart park setting up. Let's get a little more hay going over on this side. I really want that fishing to be done so that we can get more fishermen, but it's kind of a catch-22. It's You need more houses to get more people to have them available to do the fishing. See, if I put another house into construction, it's just going to take them away from working on this. I get set up houses on the other side of the bridge too, but that's a long walk. And I don't think I'm going to be able to build on this incline here. It's kind of a, I don't know if you can tell, if we get down and close here. There's, see, there's like a little bit of a hill. I don't think they would let us put houses along the river. <laughs> that yard's all lopsided. <laughs> yeah, look at that. It's like, yeah. And this is quite a walk for people then, too, if I do back-to-back -back houses. But I think that's what we're going to do. And we, we could do one facing this way. I like to give them a lot of open yard. we'll be able to okay that locked the two points together those are locked can we do something where it... no nope, it doesn't let you yeah I don't want it to be all lopsided that way and we'll put no oh, let's not put them because that would kind of stink to have window to window like that nobody would <laughs> it would be you wouldn't have any privacy in your own home. Let's put it out here. That way the neighbors aren't so confined. Come on guys, almost. Finally, they're in there working on it. We're dropped down below $600 in our account, though, so hopefully once the fall comes, which is pretty close to being harvest time, as they harvest their crops in their houses, should be able to start selling some of those crops. Let's bring on... A another worker and we got a bunch of laborers going that's good we can let's drop their pay back down to 100 percent so that a few of them will quit probably to go work on the farm let's 
Yeah, let's keep two guys working on the nails. Sorry, I hesitate so long. Um, it's already October. How much fish do we have? Uh, quite a bit of fish going on in there. So it should be stocking some of these. Let's see, what what did, what do some of these places have? They've got potatoes. Some of these that have other crops. Oh, did they already harvest? Let's see what did, yeah, they did. Okay. Okay, we got beets, carrots. Let's do some beets and carrots in some of these. Like this one here, because it's closer to these houses. Okay, we got carrots. Let's do some beets. We want to keep firewood because that's something that they're going to need for their warm. Um, carrots. Onions. Hopefully some of these houses that have... different variety will actually sell some of these crops to them. Uh, cucumbers. That'll get them into the hands of other people that need it. Didn't really do much for my income. Oh, the trading post is done. Okay, let's see, what do we have here? Well, let's bring in a manager and one worker because we're going to need to be able to stock some stuff here. Uh, potatoes, how many do we have? Temporary stock. Let's do 20. Uh, firewood, we can get that. Let's do firewood. I'm probably going to need more than that. Thatch. 20. I don't know if I have to hit enter for each of those. Yeah, we'll see. Let's look at our world map now. Problem is, is we can yeah, we can do see, we can ask for a trade. I don't have a trade. Oh, that's a river route. Send a messenger. Uh, do I want to do that? Let's. I don't really want to do that quite yet because we're gonna. What we're probably gonna want to do is get animals from through the trade. I'm hoping they will send traders to us, even if they're don't aren't sent for. Let's eat. let's take off a couple of the workers. We can reassign these fields. Flex. Uh, this one's still doing pretty good. This next season, let's put. Don't need sunflowers yet. Uh, hemp, potatoes. Oh, we already had wheat. Let's do potatoes in this one. This field, we don't have any of the blue nitrates left. So, I wonder if doing fallow would give us some of the nutrients back. Potatoes does not require... And wheat. So I guess we will do wheat on that one. And what about this field? This one is going to allow us... has a lot of blue, so... Let's do buckwheat on that one. I'm not really sure what we're going to use buckwheat for. And this one. Potatoes are always a good thing to have. Oh, they got to get their boats back. Oh, good. They're working on the houses now. Okay, let's turn these guys off the for that. And let's get a bunch of guys on to the building. 
get some of this stuff done. Oh good, they're finishing it up. See if somebody moves in right away or not. Still no smoke. Kind of a cool house, kind of butted up against the woods. Oh, well, that was a quick, quick turnaround. Let's see. Let's get some wagons going. So that I think those will be built in the carpentry building. I think so. Let's let's add to another guy to the carpentry building. Oh good, they're working on the fishing hut. And then we'll have to get some more boats. We'll need three more boats once that's done. Message. Okay, oh good, we do have a messenger departing from here. Let's see what does he have. Offering and demand, let's see. What do we need? Cows, horses, we got, uh, they want, basically they want everything we don't have. <laughs> Iron. How much do we, see we're down below $500. But we do want They're offering. How much do we want? Let's just do let's just do fifty. Okay, cool. That sends out a cart. What can we offer? We have four thousand wheat, so we want to give let's do two hundred wheat. So now we have to go to our town and we have to go to our trading post and get wheat into the trading post. So we need 200 wheat. Oops. See, I need somebody to be in here lurking on this. They need to be bringing some of these supplies over. And I think that you need to have somebody in here to offload too. Now why do they need... They need thatch. Do we not have thatch in... Oh, we got... Oh, I didn't have anybody working it. Oh, that stinks. Yeah, so they need to be processing the thatch is what they need to be doing. So I need to keep somebody on that. Oh, good. The carts. The carts are done. That'll help a lot. Boy, their quality goes down quick. Can we get another boat going? Let's see where's the boat yard. Oh, it'll, it probably will, wait a minute, where are they going? Oh, they can still place, even if they're not working on it, they can place the materials at a new build site. Fishing dock is complete, nice. Let's, uh, this is going to be great, because that's going to get us more. Let's get our boats ordered. And then come spring, which, uh, I get oh February for some reason some of our thatch roof is showing. They're busy using our bridge already. Yeah, they're gonna be working on the lie works. Really not sure exactly what the lie is gonna be used for, but come 
Come on, guys. Bring some of this. We need this in here. Let's uh, take those off and get somebody in here doing the... Oh, no wonder. Stop bribing them and they quit. gonna be neat to see how this yard gets set up. We do have a family in there now. Oh, it's, oh and they've got one nine-year-old son. Let's see, does that add any more kids? Oh yeah, we only had four now. We have six. Nice. That's literally a one-room schoolhouse. <laughs> That's all the kids they can get in there. I wonder if there'll be like a high school eventually. That buckwheat, I'm still not sure about that yet, but. Okay, here we go. I wonder, are they working on the, should be working on the, yep, they're working on the new boats, that's good. Let's get some guys working in these. Three, and we want three in this one. Actually, we probably want three in this one first. Yeah, because they've already got the bolts to use. Boy, yeah, the winter used up their... Used up their crops. Could set up. Yeah, they're definitely using this. Once we get both fishing docks going, we'll be getting a lot more fish, which right now, see, we're not showing any stock of fish in here, so. They should be working the farm right now. Yeah. Eventually, we'll be able to get oxen, and then they'll be able to plow the field, and I think that actually improves the quality of the, f the grow, I'd probably get more production. Yeah, see a plow. Don't we need to have, not sure if we need a oxen to p pull a plow or if that's a plow that they can use by hand. What is the supply of oxen to save? Oh, okay, yeah, we see we don't have any, any oxen so that, Ah, here's another town that's talking about coming. What do they want? I could sell potatoes, but then we do need potatoes too. That's the only thing. What could we buy for that? We want, oh, honey. Let's get some honey. Not very much though. Not with the amount of money we have. And let's sell Let's sell 200. So we need to get 200 potatoes in there. Potatoes. 200. See, they're not stocking it for some reason. And laborers that way they'll be able to supply it. Are they get these planted. Yeah, good, good. Not enough laborers. Yeah, no builders hired. I thought I had some hired. Oh, yeah, it's because they're all busy doing other things right now, so. Take one off of that. See, we want to keep two in there because that'll let them get those supplies in there. Oh, that's what it is because we've got the fishermen all going. <laughs> Even though they're not actually in there, where are all our people at? 
There are three in there, which this is good. That's a nice quantity of fish right there. That's good. Okay, well, we are going to call the episode right there. End it in April, and that way when we come back, we'll be getting into the summertime in the next episode. So, Well, thank you so much for watching. I do really appreciate it. I hope you enjoy the video, so hit that like button. And don't forget to subscribe if you've not done so already. I really appreciate it. You have a great rest of your day. Thank you.